All right, Bobcats, so in this video, I'm gonna go over the different blood vessels. This is an artery, both of these are veins. This, this is the valve uh, for the vein. So now let's go over some of the different layers here for the artery and then the veins. So there are three main layers that are known as their tunics. So you have the tunica intima, the tunica media, and the tunica externa. So the tunica intima includes three different layers. One, you have this, which is the endothelium. It's composed of simple squamous tissue. And then number two here, this is the next layer. It's called the subendothelium, the subendothelial layer. And then number three, this is the internal elastic membrane. So that those are the three layers that are included for the tunica intima. So then the tunica media includes this smooth muscle here. So you have the smooth muscle as well as this external elastic membrane. So they have that as number five. So these are the components for the tunica media. The tunica externa includes this, which is all these different um, collagen fibers that are supporting it. Um, one thing to note about the tunica media is that this has a large effect in controlling the diameter of the um, blood vessel. So in, a, in the contracted state, this will result in um, vasoconstriction of, of the blood vessel. If you look at the features comparing the artery with the vein, one thing you'll notice is that the smooth muscle that's found here, it's very thin compared to the artery, which the smooth muscle is thicker. The last thing I wanted to make note of is this. This is what's just adipose tissue there. And then you also have um, the different capillaries that are found, found here, the arterioles and then the venules uh, within both of these. Okay, so that's going to do it for this video.